Hey guys, as promised, Super G is back with more Song of Horror, and it looks like the very next thing we need to do, as I mentioned in the last episode, is... Wait, what is this? Nothing. Uh, so go back to that room with the, um, uh, the steam or whatever, and try to redirect, redirect that, um that pressure, I guess, uh, to that room in there so that, yo, did you see that? They were like hands. Okay. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going back. I'm not going back. Nope. Nope. No, not going to do it. <laughs> Hope you guys are doing great, man. I am so glad to be back in the midst with y'all. After Super G took himself a little bit of a, a wee bit of a vacation. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Um, okay, we need to go to the end of the hall. To the door right here. Mm -hmm. And go back into here. Okay. All right. So let's look at this thing again. So the only, the only ones that you can actually make out are the morgue, restroom, uh, West Wing, director's office, security. Um, was it the, it was the, was it the director's office? I think it was the director's office, right? Okay. Okay, so the steam is going here. What if I turn this off? How do I know which one is going to? Oh, I can't, I think I get it. So that'd be the one on the top, then the one in the middle, and then the one on the bottom. Right? I don't know. Let's do that. Come here. Where's the steam? I'm not seeing it. Okay, it's going either right or left. I guess that's for on and off. Uh-huh. How? Do I get that to come down here? I turn this off. This is very tricky. Huh. Like I'm I'm not getting any does it reset if I start over? I hope so. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do, guys. I'm going to, uh, I'm going to try to figure this out, and when I do, uh, I'll come back and you guys will see the finished product. So you guys take it easy. I'll be right back. Okay, that means I need to turn this again. Yes. Now I just need to check out exactly what I unblocked. I, I don't know. Cause I, I I don't it just guys it, it just did it I I don't know like it didn't give me a chance like it, it just it, I got him right and it just I don't know it did it on its own okay well I I okay <laughs> so I think the only place we can go let's see uh out this door make a right last door on her right. I'm, I'm guessing this is right, guys. I don't I don't know. Okay, let's go down here. And then this door here, I think. Was it here? Yes. Okay. Ooh, recording three of Baroness Prestigard, a hard wax cylinder with needle engravings. Wow. Looks like to record a testimony. I need to find a phonograph where I can play. Well, we know where one is. Cylinder. The end of the story. Please, Baroness. Give me something I can use. Oh, 
gosh. I don't know if I like the sound of this. But we, we've come this far. We've got to get to the end of the story, guys. Got to. Got to get to it. All right. Let's put it in. Let's see what happens. We still have the stethoscope. I'm not sure. I still don't know exactly where we're supposed to use that. Let's use it. Oh, I can play the cylinder if I manage to replace the needle that's broken. I don't think we we can't use this, can we? Huh. What? Yeah, I can't. What? So where exactly? Where exactly would I even use this? Let me go down. Field projector security, morgue. I have no idea where to use this. I have no idea, guys. I'm completely lost on that one. Where? Where would I use a stethoscope? I'm trying. I'm trying my best to think of where in the world I could use that. I don't. Cause like I don't have. There. There is no other areas in the in the in the home that have like a puzzle piece like this one here that says where I could use that. What? Uh, yeah, I'm a little lost on this one. Uh, maybe we could take the one from Prestigard's office. Because that's where the original phonograph is. I mean, we could try that. I guess we don't really have any other choice. I just, I've not seen. Is that door open? Am I tripping? No. Does this even show up on the, it doesn't even really show up on the map. But it does show that it's locked. X'd. Okay, well, let's, I don't know, man. I, I honestly have no idea where to use this. And I'm trying to, I'm trying to use my memory to think through this and I, I'm coming up with nothing. I'm coming up with nothing. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess we just have to I'm sure some of you are out there are like, use it here, guy. <laughs> you use it here. Uh, okay. Oh my lord, jeez. Ooh, this game, man. Oh, it is terrible for the nerves. Terrible for the nerves. But that leads me to think, hold on. Leads me to think that we're getting close. Otherwise, why would they why would they be hounding me like this? Oh no. Are you kidding me? The... Looks like I won't be using this door. Oh, you've got to be kidding. We'd have to go through the elevator again. That's crazy. Okay. Okay. Let me, uh, this is the only place I can think to start, is to come back in here. Okay. Oh. We've seen all this before already. So there's one here. Oh no, I wanted to. I wanted to get what was on it. If I could take that needle out, but I guess we don't have a choice. I, guys, I have no idea where to use this stethoscope. I don't, I have no, the things I otherwise couldn't. 
Like what? Oh, this is not good. This is not, this is not good. This is locked. There's gotta be something important in there. Uh -uh. This is, I can't even move it. And we know there's some, some wickedness going on behind this door. Look at that. Yep. I'm not even gonna entertain it. I don't know what's going on in there. And this is locked. Okay. In a way, I can appreciate that because it's almost like it's forcing us to, um, forcing us to go back downstairs, I guess. Because I've, I've cleared all of this. You know, I've, I've cleared all of this. So there shouldn't be anything for me to listen to. Like I've, I've, I've looked at all of this stuff already. So whatever it is has to be downstairs somewhere. Okay. Okay. It just dawned on me where I need to use this. And that in itself is terrifying. So let me show you on the map. Down here, not the morgue, but here, this area here where the where the light is, these are those cells that the test subjects were in. We couldn't hear what was the other on the other side of the door. Remember? So now I'm guessing with the the uh, the stethoscope we can. Um, so we'll have to get back down there. Um, Come on, come on, come on with the with the heartbeats. Come on with that. Okay, so we gotta go back down. Holy cow, this game, bro. And then, even after we do that, we have to use the lift again. I hope I still have, um, okay, let me, let me make sure. No, don't, don't cut the music off, man. Don't do that. Don't, don't do that. Gotta go back through security. I'm going back through security because I need to make sure that I have the light, the right, the light on in the right area. Okay. I'm going to light the morgue up. Let's go back out here. Because I think the last thing we turned on was the, the power for the lift. So I'm gonna turn the power on for the morgue again. And then after we do the morgue, I'm gonna turn it back to the lift again. Okay. Let's go to the morgue. Yeah. Okay. Now let's go back there. I'm trying to figure this thing out, guys. You know, I know uh, a lot of you, <laughs> a lot of you guys was like, you know, when I got so frustrated by trying to solve that um, that puzzle with the picture to get the security door open here. Uh, I was so hard on myself, man, because I, I could not, I could not figure that thing out to save my life. I just, I couldn't do it. All right, let me see. Which way do I need to go? Uh, I need to go through the film projection room. I need to go through here. And that'll take me out through there. Okay. Go through here. Okay. All right. Now my guess, I'm guessing it's not gonna, well, I guess it doesn't really matter. But we'll, we'll start, uh, we'll start with the first door to our left to go all the way up and then wrap around and come back uh, and hopefully we can figure out what it is we need to do from here because I really don't know. Ooh, yeah, we don't want to. We don't want to go that door. That's for sure. What about this one? That one too. Jeez. So I guess the stethoscope just just inherently allows me to do it. Yep, some wickedness in that room too. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Let's come around here. All right. 
There's no water in the sink or anything I can take from there. All right, what about this one? Still some wickedness. Okay, and here? This one's quiet. Open the door! All right. What is this? Yeah. A syringe. An instrument used to inject medicine, but that's not what I need it right. for. I need the needle. What is this? Oh my. Uh, Ariadne's lost drawings because I'm depicting a scene that could that could take place. Is that Daniel in front of the uh, the wardrobe door? That's what it looks like. Okay. All right. Now let's be smart. We'll go back through security. I got a feeling somebody's about to jump out at me. I I just got this feeling. It's about to happen. Am I back? Need to, no, I need to turn the corner here. I just got that feeling they, that, that, that somebody's not happy with what I'm doing here. Okay, let's go back in here. Okay. Man, I, I am absolutely on edge, bro. Like, <laughs> I am on edge. On edge, on edge. All right, so we need to go back through here, turn the light on to the lift, and then go back upstairs. Oh, oh Jesus! I don't know, but we gonna give it a minute. We gonna give it a minute. We yeah, we we not in a hurry to die, so let's just let things calm down. There we go. Okay, let's check the door again. Yeah, let's listen. All good, all good. Okay. Doing the back and forth thing. Just stay alive, man. Got to stay alive. No, that was a, a term <laughs> in my army days. For those of you that don't know, yes, I'm a US Army veteran. Uh, so, you know, we had all kinds of like sayings and stuff in the military, man. One, one of which was "Stay alert, stay alive," um, and that has definitely served its purpose in this game. And I imagine it serves its purpose in life too. You know, stay alert, stay alive. Pay attention to the surroundings. You know, don't be oblivious. Pay attention to things. Listen. You know, I've always definitely been a proponent of, uh, you know. The way the way that we are made, the way God designed us, we have we have two ears. Hold on, so I'm going right. Okay, I need to go. I need to go back through here. Um, we have two ears and one mouth. I think for a reason. We should listen twice as much as we talk. That's that's just my philosophy in life, man. You know, be, you know, be quick to be quicker to listen than to speak. I think we as uh, as a human race have a bad habit of that. We don't. We we are so quick to want to have to you know to say our point of view <clears throat> that we don't actually take time to listen to people anymore. Like we just you know instead of actually listening, uh, we are like waiting for an opportunity for us to 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 say what we want. You know what I mean? It's like you you let people talk just long. Control is vibrating. Talk just long enough. Um, just to have an opportunity to take something yourself, which we shouldn't be doing that. All right, guys. Now I have the lights on in here. Let's go in. Did it do, did it do that last time? Did the doors get stuck last time? I don't remember. All right, guys, we got this final needle, bro. We should be good. We're not in the dark. We're not in the dark. So keep your composure. All right, here we go. And those doors are locked. It leads to the other side, but we can't 
We can't do anything with it. What is down there? We can't go that way anyway. It's barricaded off. All right. Let's go in. Let's replace the needle. And this is to this final phonograph here. Okay. We still have the stethoscope, so... All right, let's do it, guys. Third time's a charm. Yes. That thing, the presence, that's what Argos Legrand called that horror. Now I know why. It's anywhere the song is. In the hospital, in Ariadne, in me, everywhere. Okay. Maybe there's no solution. Maybe it isn't something you can just end. But maybe cut it off from everything, from, from this world. Burn the bridge. Return the song to whence it came. If I take the box to that place, if I leave it there, with the presence, I need to push forward just a little longer. I need to understand. I need to put an end to this. I need to go there. I need to know. I need to make it. Lord, where are we now? I think that's that's what everyone's been trying to do from the very beginning is to return that box. Do you need my help or do I need yours? That's a great question. That is an excellent question. Among the darkness, you can see a dull and high, uh, hyphenic greenish glow. Can the rest of the class see? It'd have been cool if all of us could have seen that. She walks pretty fast. What is this? The wall is deteriorating, giving way to something else, to some place else. Always down. Right. Always down. Oh, brother. Okay. Service elevator. Lord, where are we going? games have you go down into the depths of something. Every one of them does this. <laughs> Every one. I think it was uh, Rad Brad uh, back when I used, man, I used to watch him all the time. Uh, he uh, he made a good point. He, he, uh, he said, what horror game do you know that does not have like so either, well actually no. I'm going to take from what he said and I'm going to make my own. Uh, what horror game do you know that does not have one of these three things? Sewers, an, an insane asylum, uh, or caves, or something like a cave. Every single horror game has something like that, okay? All right. Man, what on earth? Where, where are we? This is crazy. Finally made it to the bottom. Wow. Now we read something that said something about them finding like Where am I? Ariadne? Did you want me to come here? There's no turning back out the wish for it. I need to know. Um something about finding these drawing these depictions of that shadow. Oh my. Oh my. Who, 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 who might this be? Okay. Oh, oh, things to come. We saw. Oh, I, I can't get anything. 
Uh, but we saw one of the collectibles that had a picture of this very image. What is this? Who is this? We have no light dreaming. Maybe if I turn out the lantern, maybe if I turn out the lantern, but isn't that me? What will happen if, if I turn it off? Should I turn it off? Well, you don't. Um, all of the other lanterns are off. The black figure, the presence there. We don't have a choice. We can't move forward unless we do. So let's just go ahead and do it. I mean, what, what else can we do? I'm so sorry. <gasps> oh my. Whoa. What just happened? Did she release it? I don't know what this means, but I think it's important. Oh, thank God you're all right. What did you find? That doctor. I, I think something terrible happened to her. She wanted to take the box to a place she called there. Does that make sense? I think I know what she meant. Listen, there's no time to waste. Get out of there. I'll take it from here. Oh, no. Daniel? Ariadne was right. She was right about everything. I've seen it with my own eyes. E even if it was in dreams, it's true. That place, the presence. I know what I have to do. Now that I'm awake, I need to... I need to get the music box and find a way to take it there. Yes. I solved this riddle. Now that I'm awake, I can put an end to this horror once and for all. But I don't now think you did. I'm awake. I can. I can. Awake. Are you? You've got to be kidding me. What? Now we got the finale there. I thought chapter five was it. <laughs> I can't with this game. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. All right. So before I end the episode, let's try to, let's recap this a little bit. So Dr. Prestigard determined that the key to ending this permanently was to, was to take the music box back to the presence in this place called there okay and i guess that's supposed to end this terror it's all it's it's like the is the is the presence angry that the music box was taken from its its resting place and chasing after everything and everyone who ever comes in contact with that box or the music from the box you know kind of thing i don't know uh, but apparently Daniel is the one that has to get to the bottom of it uh, because he's the one that has been, I guess, the most infected or the one that still uh, that wants to get. I don't know. OK, I don't know. All right, I'm going to stop here, guys. We come back. Uh, we're going to go ahead and dig into the finale. Uh, the, the there. Uh, clearly, we're doing this with Daniel because he said he's going to take it from here. Guys, I hope you're really enjoying this game. It is. I truly, truly have. Um, and we're going to come back tomorrow and try to, I don't know if we're going to wrap it up in the next episode after this one, or if it'll be two or three, I don't really know, but we'll figure it out till we get to the end. All right, guys, Super G, don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy my gameplay and my commentary. I promise you guys, you won't be disappointed. I'm really, I'm, you know, I'm a pretty cool guy. Ask, ask, ask my followers. They'll, they'll tell you. <laughs> All right, guys, take it easy. I will see you again next time tomorrow. Later.